We lived with the Bajau Sea Gypsies and witnessed their legendary freediving skills. Hunting is the domain of the men who scour the seas with wooden spear guns. But in this Bajau community in Sulawesi, two women, Sia and Sarah, are outliers. They are hunters amid a sea of men. Money and supplies are scarce on their remote island chain, so they have to improvise, like using worn track shoes as dive boots, or even a patchwork of old clothes as a dive suit. Without GPS, they rely purely on their exceptional memory to guide them back to the best hunting spots amongst the coral reefs. Today, they are going octopus fishing. Sendiri, tahu sendiri. Soalnya kami punya suami sakit, jadi kami mencari berita. It's a curious but effective method. Sia inserts metal rods into an octopus den. The creature wraps its tentacles around this strange intruder. And once it's caught, Sia knocks it unconscious. Octopus are as elusive as they are lucrative. A very large one can fetch up to eight dollars, and that's almost a full day's wage for many here. But their catch has been dwindling. Climate change has brought on more frequent storms. One is approaching, so the women divers have to abort their hunt. Today's catch was paltry, just two small octopus. On the boat ride back, Sia finds time for a post-dive beauty regime, a local concoction to delay the effects of the blistering sun and unforgiving seawater. Back in the village, the women wait out the storm with their families. This year, they welcomed a new addition, baby Nurfaza. And at 44, Sia is a new grandmother. Despite her age, she continues to hunt when she can. Over the past 15 years, Sia has been the sole breadwinner for her family of nine. Recently, she had to take on a job collecting coconuts to increase her family's income. <laughs> The storm has passed, and it's time to sell her catch to the village middleman. He offers her five dollars for two octopus. He'll send them to a nearby city, where they'll be frozen and then sold as delicacies to restaurants in France and Japan for triple the price. Today's hunt was a letdown. But tomorrow is another day. And hopefully, this time, the sea will be kinder. <laughs>